The skin of a squash is extremely tough, so always use your strongest knife when you cut it. You suck at cooking, yeah, you totally suck. If you don't have a chainsaw, you can use a knife. Definitely take some elbow grease and scoop these guts out. Once you've got that halved, then it becomes obvious why butternut squash is also known as nature's ladle. We're gonna start carving out the squash. Whoops. So you've got your two pieces here. What you're gonna do is take a hinge, line that up between the crack. Take your screws, and just screw those into the squash. Don't over tighten them though. You might break the screw. Oh shit, it's not opening. Oh, I see. So we'll just cut this off, I guess. Okay, so that works pretty great for this end right here. So now we're gonna be able to lock it and we'll just take this handle. Great. And then, oh shit. <sighs> okay, just unscrew that. This is what happens when you pioneer something new. You're gonna run into problems, but you do that so that the people who come after you don't have to have those issues. That's what being an innovator is all about. I'm kind of like the, the Elon Musk of squash cases. And basically what you've created is a perfect holder for your banana that you can just carry with you wherever you go. So this is just a quick access, I guess. A lot of benefits to a squash case. So we're going to take a leak. <laughs> some olive oil, throw those leeks in, brown them a bit, that adds some flavor. Try not to burn them like I did. In your food processor blender, throw in the squash, garlic, and some veggie stock, and the leeks. So we'll get that blending, take that gloriousness, and pour it in the pan. I mean the pot. While that's heating up, gonna add some salt, and a little bit of pepper. Pepper, pepper. And I'm gonna throw in a bit of curry powder, because orange on orange tastes really good. Don't taste it too soon if you blend it raw like that, because it uh, bleh. Don't uh, think too much about what that sounds like. Very simple, very yummy. Squash comes from the cucurbitaceae family, which is the same family as gourds, such as the Kisarigama, the Bumptilophagus, the Peyronius, the Antony Gaudi, the Squeagle, the Hugglebleblebleble, and the Rectus Uncomfortimus. If you want a big butternut squash and you get one that just isn't buttery enough and nutty enough, simply coat it in butter and then roll it in Power Stone crushed nuts and let that marinate for seven to eight weeks. If you have one that's perfect, we're gonna chop this in half, peel it with a peeler. It's actually pretty fun. I mean, it's not roller coaster fun, but... If you don't have a peeler, just cut right down like that. Throw these into a pan. Olive oil, salt, pepper, pepper, pepper. Fresh sage leaves, what? We'll mix that all together. What the hell? Then we'll take the other half, salt. Squash has recently been named a superfood and the butter helps counteract the healthy effects. Throw some in there. Create a little river here. A little bit of maple syrup. It's probably way too sweet, but you know what? You only live however many times you get reincarnated, so. Onions on 400. It's been about 30 minutes. Just gonna wang jangle this one a bit. Spoon this butter and maple syrup over top. The best thing you can do with these is... Let's do a little test here. Mmm, sage squash is so good. Mmm. It's also good, but I think you really need to get the maple and butter in there, otherwise it's pretty bland. So dice it and then douse it. I'm gonna declare the sage squash the ultimate champion here. Regardless of how you do your squash, don't serve it like this. That's baby food, and that's condescending to anyone over the age of 18 months. And you know, butternut squash might not be your thing, so if you don't like it, try one of the other varieties like cutternut squash, or shutternut squash, or gutternut squash, or clutternut squash, or flutternut squash, or utternut squash. Going to town now, don't you get lost? Before you leave the house, be sure to wash. 
Dressed to the nines, yeah, you're looking pop. In your suit, in your pants, in your shoes. You're really hungry, you better eat some squash. Eat a steak sandwich, be sure to floss. Swinging from the trees on the grippy moss. Has some spaghetti with extra sauce. Finish it off with the side of Give me a butternut pepper cup Cup runneth over like a speeding truck Splate on my plate, I'm gonna eat it up mm.